Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today is going to be my July book haul. As per usual, I buy a ton of books, but you know, what's new? Anyways, let's get on with the video. Okay, so the first book I received from the author herself, and she has no idea how grateful I am for her and her support and sending me books and letting me review them for her and that is going to be Retaliation by T.L. Coulter. This is the first book in a new series of hers. She does have another series which I will leave the link for below. The first book being The Key. I've talked about it um, previously with you guys beforehand. I believe this one is kind of like a dystopian novel if I'm not mistaken and her other series is a fantasy series which I really enjoyed and I flew through so I can't wait to um, read through this. I have read through the first chapter um, before I received this from her so I'm excited to uh, continue on and finish it. These next set of books I got when I was visiting Barnes and Noble. One of them my friend got me. Um, the, the two that I bought, um, the first one is Dream Fever by Karen Marie Monning. This is the the fourth book in the Fever series. I have not gotten the third one yet. I have the first and the second one. They didn't have the third one at the time so I just decided to pick up the fourth one because I'm really enjoying the series. And the second book that I picked up was the second book in the Bad Boys novels. Um, the first one I read in July and that is Down to You and these are by M. Layton. I'm really enjoying this. Um, I flew through this one in three hours so I know I'm just gonna fly through this one also. This next one a friend bought me which was so sweet of them and that is Stormfront by Jim Butcher. This this is the first novel in the Dresden Files. I heard this is really good and it's going around booktube so I figured I would give it a try. I'm only gonna buy the first one for now, see how I like it and if I do love it then I'm gonna continue on and get the rest of the series but this is like a 15 book series so this is going to take some dedication. So these next set of books I got quite a few of them. They were from a book outlet order. It was really cheap and then they had that deal where it was like 10 more dollars off so I was like you know what I'm placing an order. It's too much of a good deal to pass up. So the first book that I got was Everything for Us by M. Layton. This is the third and final book in the Bad Boys um, trilogy series. So I'm not sure what this one's about but I do believe it follows her cousin instead of her so we will see how that goes. The next book that I have is Fall from India Place by Samantha Young. This is in the companion series for On Dublin Street which I read in June I think I read it in which I really loved. I really enjoy her writing so I wanted to um, continue on and read some more books of hers even though it's not from the same characters perspectives. These next set of books is the second and third in the trilogy and that is Point of Retreat and This Girl by Colleen Hoover. I believe this is the second and third. I could be wrong. I still need to pick up Slam but these were just too much of a good deal to pass up so I'm going to collect all of Colleen Hoover's books because she's one of my autobi authors. The next set of books that I got are Pandemonium and Requiem by Lauren Oliver. I have the first book Delirium in the series so I wanted to pick up the rest of them. Um, I met Lauren Oliver at Y'all West and she was just the sweetest person so I'm really excited to read her stuff now. Alright, next book that I have is the second book in a duology and it's called Breakable by Tamara Weber. I have the first book easy. I haven't read it yet. I still plan to so don't worry guys. Um, but I don't know too much about this. I don't know if it's from the same character's perspectives or not but I figured since it was so cheap on book outlet I was just going to grab it. Alright, next book that I have is going to be How to Love by Katie Katugno. I'm really kind of mad that I waited so long to buy these to buy this book because she was at Yalwes also so I could have gotten it and I could have gotten it signed. But you know what? You learn and you live. You live and you learn. So maybe next time 
I meet her at one of the author events, I will get it signed. Okay, next book I have has been another book series that's been going around booktube and this is called Murder of Crows by Anne Bishop. I don't know if this is the first or maybe the second book in the series. I don't know but I do know like this book is normally $27 so when I saw it on there for like five bucks I was grabbing it. So the next two books that I have I visited a used bookstore and I could not believe these I was so happy that I found these because you never find these in stores. The first book being Freud of the Exiles. This is the second book. The first book is Finnegan of the Rock. Um, this is These are by Melina Marchetta. But I know this is the second one in the series. I have the first one so I picked the second one. If they would have the third one I would have picked that one up too. But they didn't. And so yes. This next one I feel like I'm most proud for of this find because this book was on Book Outlet a long time ago and I just didn't get the chance to pick it up and grab it because it was moving its way around booktube and now that the, um, the hype has died down on it I really want to read it and that is Night Film by Marisha Pessel and I've heard nothing but great things especially from Reagan over at Peru's Project. And this book is normally $28. I found this for $6, guys, at the used bookstore. I could not believe that I found it. And literally, I just said that when when I was browsing in the books, I was like, there is nothing good here. I cannot believe that I wasted my time coming all the way down here. But then I spotted this literally right after I said that. And I was like, holy crap, I'm picking that up. So these next set of books... um. I had a friend that got me a gift card for Amazon so I figured I would grab some of the books that I needed. One of them was a pre-order so I'll start with that one and that is The Golden Specific by S.E. Grove. This is the second book. I don't know what the series is called but the first book is The Glass Sentence and I believe there should be one more to the series. Maybe more. I'm not 100% sure. The next book that I picked up was Pure. This is the second book in the Covenant series by Jennifer L. Armitrout. She is an auto buy author just like Colleen Hoover so I'm just going to slowly collect these and work my way through this series. This next book and final book I have an arc for but I knew immediately um, I've already read it when I had the arc the author gave it to me and I did a review for it which I will leave a link for it below um, and that is a book of spirit and thieves. I just knew I had to pick up the final copy to go along with the rest of my Fallen Kingdom series. So now I have the ARC and I have this book. The only difference is, which I'm keeping my ARC for this reason, is she gave this to me personally and signed it so this means so much more to me even though of course I had to have the finished copy because looky there it fits perfectly. Alright guys that's all I have for my July book haul. I will see you guys next time. Bye!